We got 27 good. Whoa! I looked at the, as soon as I my eyes shift off of her, see how smart this snake is? The second I shifted my eyes off, she knew that I wasn't ready to jump. Almost smoked me. That, I mean, that is incredible. So, that was crazy. You guys just saw one of the closest strikes I've had in a long time. I don't get nervous, but this time I'm a little bit nervous. What we got here, I got some bad news, got some good news. Good news is I got to pull the clutch with my daughter. Bad news, by the way, my daughter, Juliet. Uh, the bad news is there's some bad eggs. But the good, good news is there should be a bunch of world's first in this clutch. So the bad news again is she'd probably like to tear my head off. Good news is, again, I got her covered up. So let's do this. So I actually am going to cheat. This thing's so heavy, and I'm so tired because we're going to show you what we're working on. So we've got a special project here at the Reptile Zoo. Okay. Okay. Oh, man. So this is a big girl, and she's not nice. Ugh. Oh. Her head pops out. Let me know. Yeah, I don't see it. Okay, so we'll move that over. There we go. Oh, oh I never had that happen. And almost my hand I pulled my own hand off the, from the rail. You got it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that on my side. <laughs> oh, you notice? You notice why I said it's a good thing my daughter's helping me. I'm like done. Okay, so we're gonna see if this will work. Hey. Rolling our dinosaur over. Okay, so check this out. Oh yeah, she's really cool. Whoop, 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 yep, uh huh. Get ready, guys. She's gonna do the whole thing. <laughs> Take it from here. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh. Okay. Do you, have wow. do you have boxes? Yes, we got boxes ready. Oh. Snake hooks are right there. Boxes are over here. So, today is Friday. No, it ain't. It's Thursday all day. But <clears throat> we have the world's possible, world's first and only snakes going to hatch. They have not started. But we're <laughs> going to fill these up so that we can maybe have some world's first and only hatch from her. So she was, she's a motley. We bred her to a motley golden child, mochino, sunfire, possibly a platinum. Here, I can take the glass. So we'll find, whoa, 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 whoa. Can I take the glass? Yeah. Like well, she's thing. giving me, I, I'm telling you, right now, if you can see her, she's literally eyeballing me right through here. And whoop, <laughs> literally thinking about it. Okay, here we go. So. <sighs> Okay, so the good news is, even though she wants me, man, this is going to be difficult. At some point, the cameraman may have to help out and hold the box when her head's over here. And, uh, boy, she, I can just see she's <laughs> waiting. She's literally waiting for me to get in the exact position that she thinks she can reach. And I borrowed Tim's hook, which is too short for me. But what do I know? What do I know? Now, did you notice I took my guard down for one second and she took advantage of that one second. When I said this is a grumpy snake, I ain't kidding. And uh, it's, it's what it is, is she's actually only one generation from the wild because she was an early, 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 early breeding of this gene. And then what it is, is a titanium and a motley together. And so, wow, come on girl, come on. Okay, look at that. Now, remember I said there's infertile eggs? The good news is, I'm lazy to dip. Whoa, I almost got it, guys. I almost boo-booed. Okay, you think I'm playing, right? It looks like I'm dancing. Woo but she's actually, she's actually positioning herself, hiding her body over there so she can get further than it looks. Oh, man. I don't get nervous, but this time I'm a little bit nervous. They ask me all the time, oh, are you ever scared? I always say no, but this time I'm thinking I'm just too tired and slow. Okay, come on, girl. Okay, come on. 
Okay, there you go. You stay over there and bite the cameraman. Okay. So, having these is all not that. Whoa! Dang! <laughs> Woo! Told you I felt like I was off my game a little bit. Juliet, why don't you throw yourself in front of it and stop it? <laughs> Dang, that was so close. Let me wipe its saliva off my face. Okay, come on, girl. So, Juliet, when I tell you to, let's see if we can steal this clutch. Whoa. I say steal, but really, all it is is that, like, this clutch is exactly why we take the eggs. They're half bad, half good. Almost 100% chance they'll get maggots, rot, and all the eggs will die. In the wild, guaranteed. Wild animals would come in from everywhere with all that odor and stench, and they would just come eat them all. And that's exactly what we're going to do, is we're going to make another cool video for the, for... I don't know, this week, we'll make another cool video feeding, feeding the monitors the eggs. And uh, we got a pretty cool bunch of monitors right now. Matter of fact, well, come on girl, maybe, come on. She can't really get me. I know when she can get me and she can't really get me right now, which I shouldn't say that because you yeah. know what that means? Pride comes before a fall. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay. Come on girl, come on, come on, whoa. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, so I think there's only going to need one box today because there's so many internal eggs. Side? No, we can't go on that side because she'll bite us. No, not that. Go ahead. Mean, go ahead. Yeah. The other side. Okay. And of course, because of these are snake eggs, they have to all be the, up the same way. Look at that big girl. They're not really stuck together. Right yeah, they're, oh, that's that's fine. Just grab them like this okay. then. Just. Oh, there you that go. There we go. That one's straight. You got that straight yeah. up? Okay. So, hopefully we have enough eggs to get lucky. Ooh, man, there's a lot of infertiles. Way more than we expected. Whoa! Yep. Uh, I need a snake hook. Aisle three. Where where, where, <laughs> where she took all the snake okay. hooks? There we go. Okay. So, she got less than, even less than I thought fertile. So there may be 20, 20, I don't know how many eggs are as fertile. I'm gonna find out in a minute. Julie, that's a couple gonna, really cold ones. They have the cold ones, just stick them in there because it doesn't matter. So she laid earlier, but all these infertiles, we're gonna feed to some other animals around here and show you why, what happens in the wild. Because in the wild, these things get cleaned up really fast. What would happen is the insects would eat them, the birds, would, the birds wouldn't eat them because they'd get smoked. Oh, there we go. There we go, there we go. We There's got them all. So we are successful. Juliet, you've got some quick hands. <laughs> Juliet, Juliet, what's your favorite kind of animals? Uh, I like the ones we have here. Yeah. I like our gators and the monitors and stuff. She likes the big gators. I don't know if you guys ever seen any of her viral videos of her feeding the big gators, but what is that one? 50, 60 million, 100 million? About 80 million. 100 million views. <laughs> Some of the duets are funny too. <laughs> I love the duets. Now the question is, how do I get grumpy? I know how to get grumpy. Where's that? Where's that hook? So all I gotta do is I'm gonna just, I'm gonna basically touch her so she wants to come over and and light me up. And when she lights me up, she'll come over on this side. See, so she's gonna work. She's gonna work to try to hide body. She see her head will stay there. Her head will stay there, but she'll get closer and closer with her body so she has more distance of striking. So right now she's thinking. You know, if I was crazy and I like making videos, I'd take risk. But I don't like, I'm, I'm crazy maybe, but I don't want to take risk. So, otherwise I'd show you, by, whoa, I'd show you, <laughs> I would show you what I'm talking about. Now, you're probably thinking right about now, wow, why is he antagonizing her? So here's the deal. I could just grab her by the neck, yank her out, stress her whole life out, or I can let her just argue with me for a few minutes. And when the argument's over, she'll be like, okay, it's cool. And then she probably won't bite me, probably. But the point is, I won't be strangling her and fighting with her and making it all crazy. And you know what? We tried that before, it never worked. <laughs> so my point is, so there is a reason why I'm trying to get her to burn her, in, her angry energy. And I say angry, it's just protective energy. Unfortunately with this snake, it's more than protective energy. It's, she's kind of not the nicest snake in the whole world. 
So she should start be getting to the point where she's gonna think, okay, this ain't working, and come with a plan B. Now that being said, she's not ready to. You wanna cover those eggs? Yeah. Matter of fact, let's put them in the incubator, and I'm gonna deal with this in one second, because at the end of the day, I don't want her to knock her own eggs over because we're trying to save her eggs and her babies. How many we got in there? I didn't even count them. You guys ready? Guess it. Here we go. Seven. 27. 27. What did I say a minute ago? Anyway, we got 27 good. Whoa! I looked at the, as soon as I my eyes shift off of her, see how smart this snake is? The second I shifted my eyes off, she knew that I wasn't ready to jump. Almost smoked me. That, I mean, that is incredible. So, that was crazy. You guys just saw one of the closest strikes I've had in a long time. I told you I was old and I told you I was tired. Man, I'm tired. I mean, it's just a long day. Come on, girl. Come on. Come on. Yeah, uh-huh. Come on. So this is, you know, kind of crazy when you're doing stuff like this. But in real life, if you love what you're doing, you want to be careful. You want to be careful for you. You want to be careful for the animal. She's an opera singer. So you want to do this, you know, I mean, I hatch this from a little baby and I hatch its mom and dad from a little baby. So it just takes a while. Come on, come on, come on, girl, come on. And before you know it, hopefully, hopefully, the problem is, is this snake is so big too. So there's a weight issue. Whoa. There's a weight issue on top of all the rest. So normally I can just grab her. There we go. Now she's starting to, to flee. There's a, there's a fight, or, you know, flee or fight. And hopefully we can get her a little bit on the flee mode. She's still not really going there. Come on, girl. Oh, hear the gators? Okay, go ahead, girl. You can go outside. So hear that? Those are dinosaurs, right? So, I live for stuff like this. Look at that. That's Darth Gator. This is Go this is uh, Gomer. And look at uh, <laughs> the snapping turtle even got into it. But look at that. Look at the water vibrate with that intense power. Julia, you raised both these guys from babies, and now they're shaking the whole entire zoo. I know. Isn't that crazy? Dramatic. You <laughs> <laughs> For sure. So you, I'll show you. Look, want to see something cool? Show the baby gator. Oh, our little baby. Matter of fact, we just built the baby gator. It's our own little custom enclosure we're going to put inside there. So it has all the special. So. How cute. This was all, those were only this big. And now, look at that. Now they're dinosaurs calling, making, it, literally, if you were here, the whole ground shakes. I literally, look how far we went when we could feel everything shaking. So, pretty crazy. Yeah. Now the question is, can I get that snake off? You guys feeling lucky? <laughs> We're just postponing there that. Nah. <laughs> Come on, let's go see if I'm gonna be successful and don't bleed. <laughs> the problem is when you do something you love, you're willing to take a little bit of risk for it. Sometimes that means losing money. Sometimes that means losing sleep. And hopefully, in this case, it's just. Ooh. 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 Gosh. Go the other side and hold the box. But not. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> <laughs> yep, this one's a little grumpy. This one's spirited, like my children. <laughs> Like to say passionate. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would not want anything but uh, kids that knew how to stand for their own. Just come on. And this is one of my kids that's standing for its own right now. It just doesn't realize that dad's right. That I just saved all their babies. Oh goodness. We got one more infertile. I think she laid more infertiles in fertiles, which means we're gonna lose some of the clutch in incubation. But hopefully we'll get some. Oh, dang, this is really turning into a long, hard video. 
Okay, I'm gonna cheat a little bit. This is how I got bit really bad one time. For those of you who follow me, realize I broke the shoulder about five months ago. Unfortunately, that means it's weak. I say it's weak, but this is a 160 pound snake. Okay, just take that off the other side. Okay, so, whoop, this is where it gets a little interesting. Okay. Ah, she's thinking about biting me. Okay. The only reason why she didn't bite me is I didn't give her a target. Come on, girl. Come on. Come on. Come on. You got to start settling down. Come on. Wow. Man, she is just not, not. Reticulated pythons are known for their aggressiveness, but not all of them are aggressive, as you know by watching a lot of my videos. And uh, this one is, it's got a lot of genes in it, which usually means they're not, because they're more captive born and, and raised. Oh, come on. Let me tell you, if I didn't have a little bit of, a little bit of skill handling big snakes right now, this would be a whole nother video. Whoa! There. Oh. Now she'll calm right down, get back in her enclosure, feel like she's in control again. Oh, man. And that will now turn into a happier, relaxed animal because it's, she's going to be back on her own. Ah, oh, dang it. Come on. I know you're not trying to get out. Here, I got a snake hook. There you go. That didn't actually hurt. Well, she just popped out by accident. No, I know. The grippy. Come on, girl. Come on. Come on. Close your mouth. Close your mouth. Come. Your cage enclosure's right there. Come on. Enclosure's right there, girl. There you go. Come on. Go ahead. Go ahead. So this is literally like a tool to pet them. It's like to, oh, there she goes. The good part is she passed all her eggs, I can tell. There's no infertiles in her. We'll get her settled down. She'll be back to normal. And we're gonna keep living the dream. That was an easy one. <laughs> <laughs> that was really a rough one, but I knew it would be. <laughs> Luckily, she isn't scared enough, unfortunately. <laughs> Sometimes I'm worried she's gonna get bit like when she went by. But anyway, hope you had a great time. And uh, if you haven't met Juliet, there she is. Here I am. <laughs> <laughs> Have an awesome day.